Hey guys, today we're going to be making slime. And I have a Saborax. And down with glue, I have a container underneath and some water. And if we need some extra add ons, we'll be adding them. So let's get started. So I'm going to put some glue inside of a container. Well, this is a little bit glue. Try not to go on my hand. So. Oh my gosh, this is like so much. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Okay. This is about good enough. And um, so I think I'm going to mix it, which is not so much of a good idea, but I still think I'm going to mix it. Okay. And the mix is pretty good. So now we're going to be getting a little bit of borax. This is so hard to open. A little bit of borax. And we're going to be putting it into the water and letting the water cool for about what, 15 minutes, I think. Because I don't ever use borax and I'm using it. And I think this is how you use it. So I'm going to get a little, like, I don't know, what can I use? So I'm going to get this little spoon and I'm going to get a little tiny, tiny, tiny bit of borax. I think I have glue is enough. Okay, so it went into the thing and It's like horrible right now. I don't know what to add to it. You guys comment down below what you guys think I should add to it. And yeah. In the uh, and subscribe and hit the thumbs up if you guys want me to do a slime makeover. If this turns out like really, really bad. I kind of just want to keep it white. So I don't think I'm going to be adding dish soap. Because, you know, dish soap isn't white. But it is really turning into like good slime right now. 
uh, a little bit of good slime because see this? Yeah, so I think I'm going to take you guys upstairs for a while and then we're going to be um, doing it, um, like making the slime makeover upstairs. So I think we're going to be making, yeah, I just changed today's video. So we're going to be making slime, like this slime, and I'm pretty sure it's going to turn out really bad. So then we're going to um, be um, doing it a makeover, like, yeah, because see how bad this is getting? I mean, it isn't as bad as it was, but at least it isn't, like, because at least it's actually activating. So I'm going to go back over there and see if I can get, like, some glue or something. More to, like, get it. I have got glue. I'm pretty sure we can use a glue. So we're gonna put this aside. That's definitely gonna need a makeover and stuff. So this has like cooled off. We're gonna start putting our hand inside, which was kind of a good idea because when I put my hand inside of there, it started getting used to my hand. And if I had put it earlier, it would have gotten like better. So we're going to try to make this one better, and we're going to try not to put too much activator into this one. I think that one didn't work too much out, because all the activator was on top, not on the bottom where a bunch of glue was. So yeah. So this one's actually turning really, really good. And see you guys, it's like really good. I'm going to need to make a name for you guys, because I can't just keep on calling you guys, you guys. So yeah, because like when your teacher doesn't know your name, when your teacher doesn't know your name, you guys, hello, my name is Mrs. I don't know, let's say Miss Bullier, which is my teacher. Actually, this is actually turning out to be really, really good. It's still very sticky, but it's very pokey, and I like it. I actually really like this slime. This slime is the best slime I've ever made with borax. I mean, it's a little bit rough and stuff to start with, but just to start with, not to end with and stuff, you know? So, yeah. So, we're going to be putting in some, I don't know, to make it better, but we're going to see. ASMR, you guys. See, this is the slime right here. It's not actually that bad. It's just like not that bad. So I'm going to take you guys over here so you guys could be closer to me whenever I do this. So I'm going to put the glue right here so you guys could see. Okay. So I'm going to put this aside. And this is like a very good slime. I think this is actually a really decent slime. I'm gonna go get something. I'm gonna come back with it in five, four, three. Whoa, two, one. I got it. So comment down below what you guys think it is before I reveal it and don't cheat. So it is good. So first of all, it's gonna make it smell good and this helps slime. So I'm just gonna put a bit of the oil in there. But that'll become better. It's actually getting a little bit better. It's making a bit of a mess, but it's getting better. So I think, does this have any activator in it? Oh yeah, some glue in it and stuff. And that's how we really, really want. So yes, we have some food dye. And I think food dye is going to help with this a lot. Because food dye kind of like melts the slime a little bit. So we may be using food dye and the, um, the soap has really helped this slime a lot. And we're going to be using lotion too because who doesn't ever use lotion? Not on slime. Unless it's like store bought. When you know, one time my friend, she told me, so um, I got this packet of slime 
and for my birthday and it had like 13 or 14 slimes and they were actually like really really good like really really good slimes some of them were like really bad and jiggly like this one and it was like super bad but then i put and she told me not to put lotion in so i put lotion in it and it actually turned out really good and then one of them and then i put lotion in the other five and then in the other like 10 no yeah i put lotion and then in the other nine they were like so jiggly when i put lotion in i was like i'm never putting lotion in store-bought slimes ever again unless they're like this one they were they were like really really bad except for the five the five actually were good which was really nice of it. So this slime is kind of getting better. And it's like moving up to a decent place. So this little tiny piece, which we're gonna put food dye in all of it. But mostly we kind of wanna start, we're gonna leave this one behind for later. For another video you can get done another video and right now we're just gonna be worrying about this little piece right now and then we'll move on to this piece in this video so I'm gonna think I'm just gonna like go like this I think I'm just gonna give up I'm just kidding I think I'm gonna put a little bit of this over here it's kind of getting better it's getting really much better, like much, much better. So yeah, and okay, so now what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be putting food dye inside of here so it doesn't like, you know, melt and stuff. So yeah, so, well, so it melts and stuff. Um, but I can't put too much food dye because if I put a lot of food dye, then the slime will just melt. It's kind of turning the color of this, but a lot lighter. It's turning like a pinkish. It's like turning flamingo pink. Did you guys know that flamingos aren't um, really pink when they like are born? Flamingos are actually white when they're born and then they turn pink because they eat shrimp. They learned that in science class. I was actually really amazed. I did not know that until my friend said it. I was like, oh really? is inside of our science notebook. Um, yeah, maybe if we need more glue, we'll put more glue, but I don't think we need more glue. I'm gonna get the food dye, which is over here. And since I really, really, really like blue, and the green is like a blue, I'm gonna be putting some green in here. Okay. Okay, I think I kind of made a mistake here because the green does not really look too blue to me right now. I thought it did look blue, and especially with pink, it did not look too good. But since the green just faded away and just came back, this is gonna, oh, this is a nice green. Kind of looks like, um, this reminds me of land. So I'm going to be putting some red inside of here because this is just turning brown or purple. I don't know. Okay, yeah, it's just turning, it's just turning green. If you put green food dye into something, do not expect it to be um, blue at all. Never. Unless it's like a turquoise um, green, then yeah, that's technically blue. So then, yes, you can count on your senses. Okay. Okay. So I think this is just, whenever like this happens, I call it stitch goo. Because first of all, it reminds me of stitch, the noises that stitch makes, and then it reminds me of goo. So, yeah. I think we're gonna throw away the piece that was um, green. 
So yeah. And it wasn't even that nice of a green. So I'm gonna get some red food dye. This is the food dye. It's like not food dye. It's like melt dye. No, it's um gel. That's what it is called. It's gel, and I like to like put this on slime little by little, like I did the last time, and it like melted a lot. So we're gonna be putting the red, the red, the red gel so this starts to melt. That rhymed. As you guys see, I'm putting a lot like a lot like it literally looks like a slime is bleeding so yes I just do not do that correctly so we put a lot in one area which will usually red would turn it pink but this reminds me of strawberry slime so I think I'm gonna call this one strawberry slime and it's kind of melting it so that's actually really good you just might think that's really bad, but it's actually really good because my hands are all red. All of it. But since this isn't permanent and it's just like, just to like, yeah. Because like if you're baking dough, cookies and stuff, and you put the red food dye on your hand, this was wood would happen see i call it the melt dye because it's starting to melt up the slime and then i like to start adding like more slime little by little till it starts getting back to the consistency of its normal like slime how it started which i just got that a little bit red but not too red she's like super rippy Oh, that was just a bubble from this slime. Wow, it's actually really sticky. So I'm trying not to make it like that, um, that like rinse. Okay. It's actually becoming slime. Yay. So now that that's happened, we're going to grab a little piece, we're going to go like that, we're going to put it in the middle, and then you're going to start going like this. See, and then the red starts to like get off of your hands once the once you start doing that. So yeah, so I, I really recommend to get these like gel ones if you're going to be using slime that is like very, very bad putty. Slime that is like very putty ish, so yeah, that's what I would use. Sit back on the chair because then you guys aren't like you're so small. So I got it here, and I think we're getting to a type of consistency where we want to add this. And this is where we're going to stop, and then we're going to put more gel on a different piece of slime because I really, 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 really like this slime like this. Till at the end we mix it all together. It's gonna look really, really, really nice. And I have a like whole gown of glue. So if you guys want more um, slime videos, I can do more slime videos. Mm -hmm. And the people that comment down below, are going to get some shout outs and they are going to get some and at the end of each video I will be giving a Bible verse and yeah it's gonna be a verse of the day that's what I named it so we I have this like coloring book and it has like a bunch of um coloring but they're verses, so yeah. 
Okay, you guys, look at this. It's like so good. It's like so good. Like you can stretch it and everything, bubbles and everything. And it used to be this. See how good the gel is? It's super good. And this too, like they're both super good. They're like my favorite. Okay, now we put this aside over here, and then we start doing this one, which we're gonna start with the little tiny bit, like I started with that one over there, and I think that this like is actually really, really bad, and I might like start doing this one too, but I think this one's like extra, extra, extra badder than this one that I, this one was the one that I was gonna do this makeover. So yes, I am gonna still do it because I promised. If I hadn't promised, I wouldn't have done it. Cause this is just like bad. This, in, in like the second video, cause this is the first video. So in my second video, Hopefully I have like 10 subscribers by then. Um, and on my second video, I'm going to be showing my dogs. Hopefully, if I have 10 subscribers. The motivation, okay, the motivation. Yeah. This is so like gooey stuff. It's gonna, like I said in the beginning, if you guys remember, this is going to be called my strawberry slime. Strawberry shortcake, and um, I have so much more slime to do that you just wish that it was already like red and everything. Cause well, it doesn't have to be already red, but it'd be like already good or something. So I might be like, if my mom, if she buys more um detergent, and like, we stop making our own detergent. To buy more detergent, maybe I can ask her if I can start using detergent, or I can buy detergent with my own money. And for you guys, yeah, I think I'm gonna be buying detergent with my own money for you guys to be making some better slimes, and so we can be and like shaving cream and everything for you guys, so we can be making like really really good slimes together. And so you, so I can get more subscribers. I'm gonna be showing all my friends my um, YouTube like video and stuff, and even the people I don't know. You would be like, you should subscribe to Victoria Vsies, and then it'd be like, okay, and they'd subscribe, hopefully, because I really want to have about ten subscribers by the second one. And yeah, well, I mean, I don't have to even get more glue because we already have glue over there. And then maybe we can be like, my dog picks my slime ingredients and stuff. Um, and yeah, it's gonna be really fun. This matches with my shirt. Like, and then we just, oh, we should do a 4th of July slime when it's 4th of July. Like a really nice slime, and like a really nice blue slime and stuff. That'd be actually really nice. Oh my gosh, yes. Whoa, that cap just got into the bubble. It wants to get blew up. It wants to get blown up. So, yes. Really nice slime. And um, I'm gonna be putting some of this in all like in the whole thingy at the end, but I really want to leave one white, but I can't because if I leave it white, then I'll turn out um, really bad. Or maybe like, no, I have to probably put one blue, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have my shirt look for that. There wants the cap. 
so on camera my shirt looks red white and or does it look orange red slash orange white and black but actually in real life it looks is actually red white and blue don't eat that cap you're gonna choke on it matt buddy buddy and he's still eating the cap either way Cool. No, he's in the cap of the thing. Show you guys what it is when I'm done. Okay, you guys, so this is the review of um, the slime. So this is the before. Let me grab the before. I actually did this. This is the first video. I don't know. Comment down, you guys. If you guys thought this video was good, if you guys thought this video was bad. And if it was good, it shows by my subscribers. If it was bad, then I probably had, like, probably zero subscribers or like two subscribers which are the people that i want to tell subscribe so this is the before the really 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 like really really bad before this is the really 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 good before i mean after so that was before the makeover this is after the makeover. If you guys want me to start like learning how to edit videos so I can make better videos for you guys and start like using my money on stuff like that and the app like and stuff for you guys and stuff so I can do better videos and comment down below and subscribe and hit the bell notifications so you guys know whenever um, I make new videos. Bye, guys. So, wait. I did it on purpose. <laughs> so, the, um, verse of today is love one another. 1 John 3.23. It's up there. I don't know if you can make this one up or something. Yeah, you can say. But it's right there. Um, and yeah. So, see you guys next time. Bye.